In December 2007, the UK Maritime and Coast Guard Agency, MCA, recommended that because of the serious nature of the hazard posed by onload release systems, consideration should be given to the immediate implementation of a system whereby maintenance shackles are rigged to bypass the onload release hooks. This would restore crew confidence in the safety of the lifeboat, enabling them to be on board for launching and recovery, an important consideration if the crew are to be confident in operating the lifeboat in an emergency. The Bahamas Maritime Authority have gone a step further, supported by the UK Maritime and Coast Guard Agency, and issued guidance for the fitting of full preventer devices, or FPDs. Nylon loop strops of sufficient safe working load are recommended as full preventer devices. These can be connected between each lower full block and a suitable fixed point on the lifeboat. Wires could be used but the advantage of using nylon is that it can absorb shock loads and can be easily cut in an emergency. The advantage of a loop strop is that only one standing part needs to be cut to release it. If each lifeboat has been equipped with an additional serrated blade knife, this would probably provide a quick and safe method of cutting a nylon fall preventer device in an emergency. The fall preventer devices should be of such length to ensure there is no slack when connected. This will prevent possible catastrophic shock loading to the fall preventer devices and the persons in the lifeboat should the lifeboat release hooks inadvertently open. Do not use the hanging off pennants or the foul weather recovery strops as fall preventer devices. They are only to be used for the purpose for which they were designed. A second option is to replace the existing lifeboat lifting hooks with hooks where the onload release system can be locked once correctly reset. The safe launch lifeboat release hook is one such system. When the hook has been reset, a safety pin is inserted through the hook, making it impossible for the hook to inadvertently open. So remember, the two hazards identified are 1. Inadvertent release of the lifeboat on load hooks, the consequences of which can be death, which means the risk is unacceptably high. Use full preventer devices to control the risk and stay safe. 2. Being unable to release the lifeboat permanent painter in an emergency, the consequences of which might potentially be fatal which means the risk could be high. For cutting the painter, provide a serrated blade knife to control the risk and stay safe. Oh, oh. 